like to do that. <laughs> we'll, we'll call this meeting to order. Terry, if you would do the roll call. Pat Rooney? Here. Ellen Ward? Here. John Mastin? Here. Kathy Fox? Here. Nicole Cohen? Here. Please stand with me for the pledge. <laughs> I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. A moment of silence, please. Okay, thank you. I can get a motion to review and accept the agenda for the session. So moved. Yes. Helen Ward? Here. Uh, yes. Pat Rooney? Yes. John Madsen? Yes. Kathy Cox? Yes. Nicole Cohen? Yes. So I'll read the announcement now. Uh, this executive session is being held in compliance. I'm sorry, do we need to go into executive session first? Oh, I'm sorry. Either way. Can I get a motion to go into executive okay. session? So moved. Second. Yes. Nicole Cohen? Yes. John Madsen? Yes. Kathy Cox? Yes. This executive session is being held in compliance with a... Yeah. to recommend that the governing board approve the appointment of Mr. Michael Murray to the position of Director of Business Services. Mr. Murray brings 12 years of educational experience and five years of business experience to the position of Director. Mr. Murray began his teaching career in 2005 at Oregon Elementary School, where he spent seven years. In 2012, Mr. Murray became the principal at Starline Elementary School, where he has demonstrated ethical and innovative leadership for the past five years. Before starting his teaching career in 2005, Mike spent five years in private industry serving in, the business and, in business and financial roles. He spent three years as the assistant branch manager for United Rentals, where he supervised branch operations, managed budget income and expenses, managed personnel, which included hiring, training, and dismissal, managed inventory, and supervised several departments, including transportation, sales, and maintenance. He then moved to First Savings Bank while finishing his bachelor's degree, where he served as a financial services representative. Here, Mr. Murray managed customer accounts, sold financial services, and provided customer support. Mr. Murray left the bank to begin student teaching. Mr. Murray received his bachelor's degree in elementary education in 2005 from Northern Arizona University and went on to complete his master's degree in educational leadership. He is currently enrolled in the Arizona Association for School Business Officials Certification Program. To date, Mr. Murray has completed courses in school budget and finance, accounting, procurement, and in January, I'm sorry, and school business management. Uh, he will be completing the maintenance and operations course in January. Mr. Murray is currently involved in the Leadership Lake Havasu Program and is deeply involved in the community of Lake Havasu City. One community member stated, Mike is highly ethical. I would place him in the 99th percentile with quality values and morals. Mr. Murray is also described as a thoughtful and creative leader. Mr. Murray brings the financial and educational perspective to the table. His patience and his ability to listen, gather data, reflect on information, make a decision, and then implement with fidelity while focusing ultimately on the student, make him the ideal person to serve the district and community as the Director of Business Services. Thank you. Can I get a motion? I move that we appoint Mr. Michael Murray to the position of Director of Business Services and authorize Mrs. Asire to engage Leanne Burns from the professional group to provide, to provide coaching and support. I second. Terry, if you'll record the vote, please. John Mastin? Yes. Kathy Cox? Yes. Ellen Ward? Yes. Kathy Cox? Yes. Nicole Cohen? Yes. And, uh, Congratulations. 
and I wanted to ask if everybody in the room would please refrain from posting or communicating about this while Mike has the opportunity to go back to his staff and communicate this. We know how quickly things spread, so if we could please wait until the announcement comes out, you know, from the district before there's any Facebook posts or texts or Twitters, that would be fantastic. But Thank you. welcome to Thank the you. district office team, and I know you'll be extremely successful, and I'm really excited and Thank you. thankful. Thank you very much. Congratulations. Congratulations. All right, I think that finishes our business. Is there any other announcements? Can I get a I have a question. What time will you be able to notify your staff? Well, I, I believe the directive was to do it like as soon as I get back. So <laughs> I'm, I'm going to meet with just during lunch times, just okay. meet with pockets of oh, the teachers so, and make the rounds with So them. everybody will know by, say, 3 o'clock. Oh, yeah, before I, that, yeah, before I, then, I'd say by probably 12.30. It would be, <laughs> I'm, I'm setting the expectation. Right. Yeah. 1215. I will send out an everyone email, and at that point, feel free. Yeah. <laughs> we'll talk about it just briefly, and then maybe gather at the end of the day and have more of a, a formal conversation. I just don't want them to start hearing it from other people. Sure. And just um, for information for also the staff who are in the audience, and I don't know, Ms. Murray, if you know your whole staff came in behind you. <laughs> <laughs> um, our expectation is his start date will be February 1st. Does this have anything to do with your roof? <laughs> <laughs> everything to do with your <laughs> Well, we welcome you, Board, and I just want you to know, just for your own sense of peace of mind that the board's behind you. If you need anything, you for, feel free to come to us. Thank you. That means a lot. There's, there'll be a, a slight learning curve, but I, I will tell you that you know, I'm committed. Uh, we've been in this community for a long time. I have a wife and three children, two of which go to our schools. Um, I, this is an amazing opportunity. And I, I'm just appreciative of it, and I look forward to keeping our roots here for, for quite some time. So thank you very much. Great. Mm -hmm. Okay. Can I get a motion to adjourn? So moved. Seconded. Kathy Cox? Yes. Don Nasby? Yes. Pat Rooney? Yes. Helen Ward? Yes. Nicole Cohen? Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, thank you everyone. Thank you.